guys, Mini Game HD here, and today I will be showing you guys the best build for a striker on um, Pro Clubs FIFA 15. Uh, so yeah, guys, this is also the best build for PlayStation 3 and for and probably Xbox too. Uh, at the moment, I'm using a PS4, guys. So yeah. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a comment down below and please subscribe and like the video. So yeah, guys, that's the first name, surname. You can choose everyone. I do like a boss. Uh, you can be known as everyone. Uh, so yeah, guys, guys, if you have a child out focus, please check it out. It is an absolutely fantastic game mode on FIFA 15. All my YouTuber friends, we all play it. So please guys, please check it out. FIFA 16 we will be doing pro club as well. So yeah guys, I'll also be doing the best build for FIFA 16 as well. So yeah guys, this all this doesn't matter about your pro. You can put the oldest pro you, you, you think and it still will affect the way he plays. Um, oh my name, never really could go that far. Anyway guys, so yeah. Um, this doesn't matter either. You can have anything you want. It doesn't matter. Whatever. Um, basically, guys, the best position for a forward is play center and then a finisher. The reason why I said finisher is because the five star skilling is you have five star skills as well as if you're a target man. Yes, the heading accuracy is good. The shot power is good. But then again, if you think about it, the shooting's not as good for a forward. So, yeah guys, in my opinion, I would choose finisher. Creator is more of a passing sort of striker who like lays other people off, just sweaties and everything. So if you're more of that kind of person, I would say creator. But in my opinion, finisher is the best one to use. So yeah guys, uh, that's the positioning build what I'd use uh, yeah guys that, that's a positioning the physical always have 5 for 8 always as you can see 5 for 8 is the best one there so far as you can see it is 80 80 80 acceleration 80 agility that this isn't your actual this isn't actually your player stats this is just giving you an example of what it is so guys don't think that you have 54 strength, 79 speed speed because you don't. You have more than that. Especially because I'm an 87 striker at the moment. So yeah. The way I always do 178 uh, because that it also is the best one. Because if you use these, you don't get, they're not that, it's not that good. Because at the end of the day, you need the strength as well. Because it does matter about strength. Uh, so. 178 is the best one for strength as you can see because it just turned on to average so yeah guys body type always have lean because if you're if you're average you can't run that fast and it's really hard to control a player he'll have a lot of he'll have a lot of strength maybe but it's really hard to control the player so yeah guys in my opinion i would choose lean my preferred foot doesn't matter what it is. I, I'm a left footer in real life, so I just put left foot on my pro because I'm used to it. Um, guys, also, this doesn't matter. Whichever you have, it really doesn't matter. You can use my build if you want. Um, traits. It's really important to use what you use the most. My opinion, finesse shot, power free kick, skill dribbling, fancy passes bicycle kicks are the best um, are the best ones to use and they're actually the best five here to be fair um, my opinion I wouldn't use outside foot shot because the outside foot shot trait it's it's OP but if you want to use your weak foot accomplishments that that is not what you want that is completely out of it. You do not want that. Uh, half free kick, you have to earn that. But then again, uh, I put that on because I've earned it. Um, skill dribbling, always have that on. Always. 
because that is the most important to be fair if you don't have that on then there's no point playing basically because that is just the best trait that is there um, including finesse too guys uh by s oh sorry fancy passes you don't have to have these on but see as well there's no other good ones that i could put on uh no, none of the ones that i need i prefer fancy passes because it looks awesome when you just pass the ball and you don't just want to do one fancy pass you want to trick your opponent as well at the same time bicycle kicks those are fantastic for your accomplishments sometimes and most of the time you don't do them because you have to hold the l2 button for it so yeah guys um these two are for the, these three are for the goalkeepers guys and after Coming up after this will be a goalkeeper uh, to uh, build the best goalkeeper build. So yeah, guys, uh, this personality doesn't matter either. Uh, you can have anything you want. So yeah, uh, yeah, guys, that's the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to leave a comment down below in the description. And please don't forget to tell me how good the video was or if this was useful. So for now, guys.